So the goal is to pack half a million meals for people who don't know where their next meal is coming from. Light Orlando and U.S. Hunger, along with other local organizations, teamed up for a massive food packing event at the Central Florida Fairgrounds. And New Six's Emily McLeod was there with some 1,500 other people who showed up to get results. For the people receiving your food, I would say that we love you. There is hope. People are showing it today by being here for you. Deliver hope together. Let's go. More than 1,500 volunteers signed up to help pack 500,000 meals with Light Orlando, U.S. Hunger, and several other organizations. Laria Rodriguez came in from Orange City with her family to help pack meals. We should all take time as, as much as we can, you know, whenever we can in our lives to take time and just think about what God has given us and help others. Jamima Kanga is with Frontline Innovation Studios and says she brought kids who are a part of Frontline to help volunteer on Saturday. They're just packing food, but really this is showing them that we're all in this together and if we work together, we can make a bigger impact. up their boxes. They, of course, had to put on their super cool hair nets. Now, what they're packing up today is 48 bags of red lentil jambalaya. This is a really healthy meal with grains, dehydrated vegetables, and a protein is in here, too. But not only are they giving back, they're having a pretty good time doing it. So another day of work for U.S. Hunger. U.S. Hunger CEO Rick Witted says the food packed at Saturday's event will ultimately go to families who are experiencing food insecurity. Maybe for some families it's just a season where we can't make ends meet and we're seeing that so much more than we've seen since the pandemic, honestly. Troy Wright with Light Orlando says events like this show people that giving back can also mean having fun. It, it's showing the, the youth in our, in our community that, that we can give back and just really have a great time. It doesn't have to feel like work. Results, in Orlando, Emily McLeod, Getting Results, News 6.